Have you ever purchased a SIM card just because of a certain lucrative offer? For most of us, this happened when Jio was launched. The entire country wanted their share of the SIM card's benefit. The most important part while purchasing the SIM card is that it has to be linked with your Aadhaar card. However, it creates problems when you tend to purchase more SIM cards and link them with your Aadhaar. We do it seeking our own benefits. What we don't understand is that it can be misused. All your private details along with your bank are connected to the Aadhaar. Hackers can easily trace it and misuse it. Sometimes it happens that your phone or SIM gets lost. Even during this legit problem, it can be misused. Due to this problem, the Department of Telecommunication has issued a new portal. This portal is named Telecom Analytics for Fraud Management and Consumer Protection, that is TAFCOP. Through this portal, you can easily check all the phone numbers issued against your Aadhaar. The Department of Telecommunications DOT, has taken several measures to ensure proper allocation of telecom resources to the people. As per existing guidelines, individual mobile subscribers can register up to nine mobile connections in their name. However, following the guidelines and checking the registered numbers is of primary importance. How to check all phone numbers registered against your Aadhaar And hence guys, here's a step-by-step -step guide to check how many mobile numbers are registered with your Aadhaar card. The first step is to open any browser on your phone or laptop or computer. After this, go to the Telecom Analytics for Fraud Management and Consumer Protection Portal website by typing tafcop.dgtelecom.gov.in on the open tab. Once the website is opened, a text box will appear. You have to enter your phone number on that box. Then, click on the Get OTP tab just below it. You will receive a one-time password, that is the OTP, via SMS. Enter that OTP in the text box and click on the Validate tab below the box. After this, a list of phone numbers linked to your Aadhaar will show up in the next page. It will show three options. Before clicking the options, you have to fill in your name in the box above the numbers. Your name should be the same as your Aadhaar. After filling in the name, see the list of your phone numbers. If you want to remove a particular number from the list, click on the small box in front of that number. After the small box is clicked, go through the three options. The three options are, this is not my number, not required and required. Click on the not required option. Once this is done, you will receive an SMS notifying that your request is taken into consideration. The SMS will also provide you with a tracking number. This tracking number will help you see the status of your request. Then, type the tracking number in a box which is just above the box where you had entered your name. After entering the tracking number, click the Track slash Cancel tab adjacent to the number box. Once you click the tab, a window will open showing you the exact status of your request. Hence, you can verify it from time to time. So guys, through these simple steps, you can identify all the numbers linked with your Aadhaar. You can systematically remove them too and ensure your safety through the correct way.